Jeeweev Galer, Kotcharov, and Smith Shriana, and Sa Anna Hus Erm, our school, Kloshinokre, a Hasbonch Steve. Hello, my name is Kieran, and I'm very happy to welcome you to our school, Kloshinokre. Please come to us now, I will introduce you to our principal, Kloshinokre. Green. <laughs> Fair to fall to Rogue and Choke, Colossian Alcre, which you and Ida Older Shop, Katar and Lina, or Krila Agner Lina. You're all very welcome to Colossian Alcre to our open night, uh, virtual as it is, and uh, circumstances don't allow. But what I'd love to do is to welcome you all here in person. Nonetheless, I'm very confident that the video that we have compiled here will give you an insight into our school. Uh, give you an overview of the curricular provision here at Kulash and Alcray. Also, um, you'll get an insight to the wide and very varied list of extracurricular activities that are provided here by the teachers and indeed it enhances the, the learning environment uh, for our students here at Kulash and Alcray. Most importantly, what I hope that you'll pick up uh, in the video is that we have in Kulash and Alcray here a wonderful atmosphere. I'm very proud to be working in this school, a very friendly and caring school. In our mission statement, we set that out, that the school would be a happy and a safe environment where your son and daughter can flourish and where we will do our very best and strive to bring out of them their full potential. So I hope you enjoy the video and thank you very much for your time. So Sweden and Shah Shoshit. I'm the Deputy Principal here in Kloshta Nachre and Fulcher of Galeer. My role is very much involved in supporting the well-being, academic success and social development of our students. We pride ourselves in having a good relationship with our students. The relationship, I believe, is achieved through a strong code of behaviour, equally coupled with a strong pastoral care policy. Both of these help us to provide a safe and happy environment for our students. We are aware that the transitioning from primary to secondary can be challenging, even daunting for some students. In our efforts to support your son daughter with the transition, we have the following in place. An information evening in April in preparation for starting with us. Regular contact and visits to the primary school. An open day. A summer camp which gives the students an opportunity to meet with classmates in advance of starting. For the students themselves, two induction days in August where first year students attend school and also an overnight bonding trip in September 2022. For you, the parents, during the second week in September, we will host an information session at the Kloshta at which uh, we will discuss subject choice and matters in general. I'd like to mention at this juncture the subject provision for junior cycle. At the college that all students take nine subjects and two short courses at junior cycle. The six core subjects are Irish, English, Maths, Science, French History and two short courses of P and CSP. After a taster period approximately three weeks, students choose three of the elective subjects, business, geography, art, technical drawing, metalwork, German, home economics, woodwork and music. The taster period is in total nine weeks in which students sample all the elective subjects. Hi, how are you? I'm um, Maureen and I work in the Career Guidance Department here in Colossian Lockray. Um, I suppose when we think of Career Guidance we think a lot of fourth, fifth and sixth years but it actually does start in first year with your students and continues through second year and third year with different organisational skills, study skills and just settling into school in general. Transition year is probably the place where it is more um, more of a focus on it um, for our students because they start with work experience, making CVs and so on and they also get this profile which is the REACH profile which they get a book and they also have an online profile which they use during transition year, fifth year and leaving cert. 
Um, on this profile, they get to do self-assessments like career sectors, interests, personality tests, multiple intelligences, and so on. Um, so this plays a huge part in career guidance here in the school over the three years. As I said, transition year is really important, but also fifth year and leaving cert, we have um, a class with them every single week. And we also have one-to-ones with every student in fifth year and in leaving cert also. We really focus on speaking to different colleges, having guest speakers in the school also, and with their CAO um, application, DARE applications and HERE applications, and also anything that they may be interested in, post leaving cert courses, apprenticeships and so on. Um, we're always here to chat about any of the options that are ahead of them in the future. And before you know it, your son or daughter will be in transition year. The age of lean, as we call it here in Colosh San Acre. TY is compulsory as we believe so strongly in the benefits and the results of spending a year concentrating on self-development. We offer a multitude of activities to develop social skills and life skills, and there are lots of fun trips as well. We encourage creativity in our students who love to take part in cool drama, singing, dancing, visits to shows, art competitions, junket tour, the list is endless. TY is a year for students to find themselves and develop their passions. Some say the Kjol drama is the highlight. Others say the Thuris Harlar is the highlight, the overseas trip. We have great fun on planes, trains and automobiles before we even reach our destination. Younger students see the activity and the enthusiasm of our TYs and look forward to making their mark when their day comes. Hi, it's Mr. Sean. I'm the head of the PE department and the wellbeing coordinator. In the Kloshta, we understand the importance of physical activity for our students. Our focus is on participation, having fun, learning and improving. Physical activity is for everyone, and we provide a great variety of activities through PE and extracurricular options. We're really excited to have introduced Leaving Cert PE as an examinable subject this year. Physical activity adds so much to the lives of our students. We've had big wins at both provincial and national level, However, the true success is in the friendships formed, the character built, the healthy habits developed, and the satisfaction that comes with realising you're capable of so much more than you ever thought. Our students' wellbeing is a key priority in Cloche de Nacre's curriculum, with PE, SPHE, and CSPE on the timetable. We also have a dedicated wellbeing class for junior cycle students. In first year, the main focus of this class is on helping our students settle into life in the Kaloshta, discussing any challenges encountered and coming up with solutions together. We support our first year students in many ways outside of the classroom, for example through getting to know each other on a fun-filled day trip or through our chorus Korja, which involves seniors supporting our first year students in a relaxed environment. As a school we celebrate many occasions together throughout the year and these create a wonderful atmosphere from showing pride in who we are to showing pride in where we're from and so much more. And the reason that I'm so happy I chose to go there is the atmosphere that the school has. It's so obvious about how much the teachers care about the students and it's such a good place to make friends because the classes are small so you get to see and talk to everyone and you get to grow close to so many people. I suppose because of the size of the school we're able to form a more personal relationship with our teachers this helped me massively as I felt more comfortable going to our teachers, whether it was a personal problem or a problem with this subject. Klosh and Ocker was a great place to go to secondary school. As well as that, the, uh, the sport there is very good. There's everything from football to volleyball. And it's where I really developed a gra for the Irish language. I remember when I was in primary school, I had to make the very stressful and difficult decision on what secondary school to go to. I was torn between two schools in Athenry. The very last minute I decided to go to Klosh Nockery and without a doubt was that this was the best decision I've ever made. Trust me when I say this school is really something special. The atmosphere within the school is one of positivity and camaraderie. The relationship between the teachers and students is really something unique. I remember when I was making this decision, my parents would worry that I'd struggle with the Irish. I can tell you firsthand that there's nothing to worry about. I really grew to love and appreciate the language. I'm now third year in college studying biochemistry and zoology. Um, I didn't have any issue whatsoever with the transition from Irish to English and neither did any of my classmates. 
And really, it's only now that we've left the school and we are in university that we fully realise how lucky we were to have been a part of such an inspiring and caring school, such as Cloughtonacri. Hello, my name is Mary. I'm a parent to two boys in Cloughtonacri at the moment, one in fifth year and one in second year. We chose the school because of how easy it was to get to from our location in Tume. The variety of subjects that are open to the boys is great. The boys also have a lot of opportunity for extracurricular activities in the school. Uh, my name is Pat and I have two children, Molly and Jack. Molly is a third year student in the University of Limerick, having completed her leave insert here in 2019. And Jack is currently a fifth year student here in the Kalashta. So I've had a lot of dealings with the Kalashta over the years. Every student counts regardless of their academic abilities and the teachers work hard in trying to get the best out of students. Our Irish would be very limited. That didn't affect Molly or Jack's ability here in the school. Hi, I'm Eva. I have three boys in Knockery. They all did primary school in Gaelskill Bahija in Oran Moor. Um, I gave them the choice of how to proceed with their education, whether through Irish or English, um, and they all chose Knockery. They're happy, they enjoy school, they enjoy their friends. One of the other good things with Knockery is that class sizes are quite small and they settled in really well. One of my worries was that the sports wouldn't be competitive enough in Knockery, but that proved not to be the case. I'm also aware of the excellent academic achievements by the Kalashta, who, you know, have achieved very, very high results in the students' leave inserts over the last number of years. One of the key things also was the use of technology within the classroom. It's a great experience for the boys from a young age. The use of technology within the school, I felt, was a great advantage for the boys when the um, pandemic hit in March 2020. It just meant they were comfortable in the environment of um, online teaching and the online space. I suppose the thing and the element that stands out most for her, and for me as her parent, is the sense of community here in the school and also the special relationships between the teachers and the students is led by the principal Breen, who leads by example. I've seen here him on many mornings when he opens the school, chatting to pupils, chatting about how they're getting on, asking them, you know, how life is going for them, and also giving them words of encouragement. So reasons that we picked um, Kalosh and Akri for the boys is um, that cousins of theirs had already attended the college and we had heard lots of good things about the school. Uh, okay, so you're very welcome back. I, I hope that you've enjoyed the video thus far and that you have some insight and understanding now of what we provide here at Kalosh and Akri. I'm very proud of our students' academic successes um, year on year. They attain very high marks in the Leaving Cert examination and typically our students would be performing at three times and four times uh, the levels that you'd expect to see nationally. Uh, so if we take for example uh, nationally 10% of students would exceed 500 CAO points in their Leaving Cert whereas here at the Colostia we would uh, have three or four times that having 30%, 40% of students in that um, category. So I, I am very proud of those. I'm equally proud of the extracurricular activities that we provide here at the Colostia and the efforts that the teachers make to enhance the uh, learning experience for the students while they're here with us. And on top of all that, I'm extremely proud of the success we have had over the years in nurturing and maintaining a, an atmosphere and a culture which is very caring and friendly because it is very important to me that our students when they graduate from the Colostia after six years when they look back and they reflect on their time here that that time is filled with happy memories and pleasant encounters with friends and teachers and that to me really is the litmus test of our school here so in conclusion I'll draw your attention to our webpage where you will find additional information. Our brochure can be downloaded from there.
but also you'll have uh, information for first year subject options as discussed earlier. There's a detail there on the school uniform, on school transport, and indeed on um, Irish medium education uh, generally and the benefits of Irish medium education. So with that, I, I will conclude by saying that I hope we've addressed most of the questions you may have as, as a parent of a child in sixth class or indeed as a young boy or young girl in sixth class thinking of second level education for next year. Um, there may be other uh, queries that you might have, so I'd invite you to make sure to contact us by phone or by email, and no matter what it is, if there's any way in which we can clarify or support you in making your decision, um, be sure to do that. So with that, I'd say thank you very much for taking the time to, um, to look at this video, and I'd say for now,